apparently the the tropical storm is heading a little bit north, which means we still have to stay vigilant from Belize City, Belize District, Orange Rock, and Corozal. So we have we are quite prepared and and um, ready for in the event because this. This system is, is, is a wide system and it could throw a lot of rain, especially in the northern section of the country. So our NEMO team is standing guard and in the event that happens, then uh, we'll be ready to be out there to assist those people in those communities. I know that the various emergency uh, management organizations, DEMO and CIMO, have been activated. Um, I also know that you are liaising with these organizations to see what their state of preparedness is. Uh, can you speak for San Pedro or other um, outlying areas in the Keys and what have you? Well, we put out our advisor uh, in San Pedro as well. We have our team out in San Pedro that is uh, capable and well prepared in um, Kikaka, San Pedro. Um, and Belize City, we have the Belize District. We have the Orange Rock and Corazal district as well, uh, up to speed and ready to function at a moment's notice. Residents to pay attention to the Nemo warning and to make sure that they stay safe, move away from flood uh, prone areas, and uh, just be alert uh, for this, uh, this system might be impacting our area between 8 p.m. and approximately 12 a.m. in the morning, but a system like this could change at any time. So we don't want to to be caught unprepared um, in the event that we know normally our people they will move when they see when they see the, the sky get dark and the rain and thunder and lightning. But most of the time that is not the case. When you see that, it's because it's already upon us. So pay attention to the Nemo Nemo advisory and make sure that we. We are on top of four games.